In this video, you'll learn how to create a new Aura using HP Reveal on a desktop computer or laptop. So once you log into your account, assuming you have an account, you want to hit the Create New Aura with the little plus sign. Once you do that, you will have the option to upload a trigger image or select from existing. So when you upload, you'll be able to upload from your Dropbox. Uh, if you have a Chromebook, it'll go from Google Drive um, and so forth. So I'm going to select from existing triggers. OK, and let's pick the coconut. OK. All right, and then once you click the coconut, um, you'll be able to edit your trigger image. Um, the trigger image is, is basically what you look at with your AR scanner and that will activate uh, the AR when you look at this image. Okay. For now, I'm going to go to our next page where you add your AR overlay. Okay, to add AR overlay, you first want to click to upload overlay. Again, you can upload an a video, you can upload an image, an audio, a 3D model. So for now, let's, let's upload an image. Again, you browse. Let's pull up Mario here. As an example, you can give it a name. Browse a description. Save it. And once you add Mario, you can, or your AR in general, you should be able to adjust the size of your AR by just clicking the corner and dragging it. Okay. And you have a few little options with check boxes. Um, if you want it to be hidden initially, it can be if you want to fade in, which is what I usually do. So when you scan it with the AR scanner, your AR overlay will, will slowly fade into you, into view. And then you can also add actions. So there are different types of actions when certain things are done by the user. So I typically use when overlay is tapped or double tapped or has faded in. You can also do after a time delay. So for example, after overlay is tapped, you add an action. So you can load a URL, you can um, make the AR full screen, uh, you can do random actions and things like that. So let's load a URL. That's the most common one I use. So if I look up, okay, funny cat videos. Paste the URL and hit save. And I can add more than one action as well. So if it's double tapped, we can, let's say, make full screen. All right, and then save. Okay. And then I always like to save just afterwards just to be safe. And then you can always preview your AR. And basically with the preview, um, you would be able to use your phone, your device, your tablet to scan the image and uh, 
using the HP Reveal Studio app. And if it works, it will, the AR, the Mario will pop up over top of the trigger image. So you can continue to add AR if you'd like. You can add as many, really, um, as, as you'd like. When you're finished, uh, you continue to hit the Next button, give it a name, a hashtag so people can find it uh, on the public domain. And when you believe you're finished, you can hit Save, close it, and now you can see that all the AR is available on my Aura. And you can always go back and edit it by double clicking it to go back to all edit features. You can also make it full screen. And that's how you create an Aura or AR using HP Reveal on your computer desktop.